Hi everybody, I'm June Carlson, and I have the privilege this year of being the Rotary Advisor to this wonderful Interact Club and these wonderful students from Riverwood International Charter School. Um, before we actually do the inductions, I just wanted to do a brief introduction of everyone that's here today. Our president this year is Hannah Arney, and just give a little wave so everyone knows who you are. Um, Hannah was our vice president last year, so we welcome her back this year in her new role. Um, we have co-vice presidents this year. We're very excited about that. First is Rachel Carlson, who's a junior. Um, she's an active third year member, and she represented us on uh, Saturday at the Interact Fall Conference. Next, we have Infato. Uh, she's a senior. She ran our efforts last year for the hygiene and food drive. Um, our secretary is Ernay Williams. Ernay also helped with the hygiene and food drive last year. And she had the privilege of attending RILA and had a wonderful time this past summer. Uh, our treasurer is Jordan Rozier, and um, also a senior, and she also attended RILA this summer. And our historian this year is Rachel Gill. Um, Rachel is a senior and was an active member of the club last year, too. And last but not least, we have Grace Brown. Thank you so much, Grace. She's our sponsor at Riverwood. She's an English teacher. She teaches ninth grade magnet and 10th grade honors, and also in her spare time is the assistant track coach. Correct. So <laughs> she's, a, she's a busy woman, and we really appreciate her involvement this year, and most of all, um, her enthusiasm. We're looking forward to a great year with all of you great folks. So, okay. Like its rotary parent, the Interact Club is governed by its board of directors. Those board officers are the president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, and directors that are appointed for specific tasks in the club. Today we have the pleasure of installing these Interact officers for Riverwood International Charter School. The primary role of the president is to lead the club, making sure it's, it functions effectively. The president plans and conducts the meetings, delegates responsibility to others, and communicates and collaborates with the club sponsor and Rotary Advisor. Do you, Hannah Arney, agree to serve the Riverwood Interact Club in these capacities this year? I do. Thank you. Thank you, Hannah. So a round of applause for the president. <laughs> this year we have two vice presidents. We will start with Rachel Carlson. The, the vice president's role is to support the president. The vice president also would preside over the meeting in the absence of the president. Work with the president on special assignments and stay up to date on all the club's goals and activities. Do you, Rachel Carlson, agree to serve as co-vice president in these capacities? And do you and Dado IA agree to serve as co-vice president as well in these capacities? Thank you. Let's hear it for our vice president. <laughs> the secretary's primary role is to help the club function effectively by maintaining club records, taking minutes at each meeting, and communicating with Rotary International with an annual report. The secretary also corresponds with the Sandy Springs Rotary Club when so directed. Do you or Nate Williams agree to serve as secretary in these capacities? I do. Thank you. Let's hear it for our secretary. <laughs> our treasurer works with the secretary to maintain accurate financial records and perform such duties as collecting dues, preparing routine reports, depositing collected fees to the school sponsor, help design and execute a budget for the year, and present an annual report at the end of the school year. Do you, Jordan Lozier, agree to serve as a treasurer in these capacities? I do. Thank you. The director position of historian is vital to the growth and maintenance of the club. It is the responsibility of this person to document with visual, audio, 
and concrete objects all of the efforts of the club. The director works with the board and is directed by them. Do you, Rachel Gill, agree to serve as the club historian in your capacity as director? I do. Thank you. And Grace, thank you so much for your sponsorship and we would like to pin you and we look forward to working with you this year. Having heard your public declarations, the officers of the Riverwood Interact Club are now duly installed. We welcome you to the Rotary family of service and ask that you join us in reciting our code of conduct, which is the four-way test. Is it the truth? Is it fair to all concerned? Will it build goodwill and benefit friendships? Will it be beneficial to all concerned? Thank you and congratulations to all of you.